Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to episode 5 for building the most isolate in LEGO. So this week, basically what I worked on was trying to finish the uh, LDD file for the shuttle. Um, and I'm glad that I did that. Um, the one thing, uh, the one problem with that was uh, I didn't finish it in time for the Sunday deadline. I actually finished it today. Um, on Monday, which is when I'm uploading this, but um, yeah, so the first thing you'll probably notice is obviously the top wing. That's probably the biggest step uh, since the last uh, update, and then the like top side paneling uh, areas, I guess you could call those. Um, so basically, pretty happy with how well everything turned out. Um, the top wing is pretty well secured, I think. Um, the one Technic beam that I'm selecting right now is 15 meters, or 15 M, the length, I guess. Studs, I think it is, maybe? I don't know. But anyway, so that's a pretty large Technic pin. I'm going to clone it right here. But, uh, bring it, yeah, yeah, you can kind of see. It's, it's a pretty, pretty large, uh, Technic beam there. So, that goes, like, all the way down into the ship, and then the ones next to it also go... Not as far, but still decently far into the ship. So, um, yeah. So I think the the wings should be pretty well connected. Uh, the back engine part uh, goes pretty much like all the way through uh, as well. So pretty happy with that. Um, obviously, I don't know about the sand anymore. Like, it's probably not going to support this thing's weight how it is. It probably needs to be a lot longer in the back, but. That's like the least of my worries right now. Um, in my like Tatooine, it's gonna be like landed anyway, so it won't need the sand. But um, yeah, so basically, um, base yeah. So this week, I'm going to be trying to buy all the parts for this. I don't know if I'll be able to do that with the amount of money I have, but I'm going to be trying to to buy all the parts I need for it. Um, so I don't really know if there's going to be another uh, episode next Sunday. Uh, I might take a, you know, a week break uh, from it just to try and get all the orders in and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so I, what I'm showing right now is this is all snot. Like the massive panel piece that I have under the cockpit is basically what the large white sections are. And basically it all had to be snot because of the tile like if you tried to put a tile there it sticks up and it looked really really odd so basically i just you know went for snot flat it looks pretty nice i'm pretty happy with how it you know turned out and came out and stuff like that um but yeah so basically the only thing i have to change on my shuttle is i think the head is too small uh, I think it should be, it's not terrible how it is right now, um, but I definitely think it needs to be improved and made a lot larger. Um, and then also this thing, I was pretty happy with how it came out, the back turret. Uh, it's just like a Travis brick in there with a bunch of random pieces all connected around it. And I think it turned out pretty nice. It has the correct look. Um, it has a nice effect and stuff like that. Um, so... Yeah, that's about it for this update. Um, basically, the whole week was trying to finish up this shuttle, and I did that. So that's, you know, kind of it. So, um, yeah. But anyway, I just apologize once again for not having this out on Sunday because I finished the shuttle today, Monday. So then, yeah, kind of wanted to have it finished because that's like, yeah, I mean, that's just, yeah, you got to do it. So. Yeah, but thanks for watching. I know this is a shorter video compared to last week's, which was kind of like 15 minutes. Um, but yeah, so I'm pretty excited with this shuttle. I think it turned out like really, really nice. Um, so uh, yeah, I think that's about it. So thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.